Welcome to Aptitude Destination. Please pause the video and read the question completely. A student appeared in six papers. The maximum marks are the same for each paper. His marks in these papers are in the ratio 5 is to 6 is to 7 is to 8 is to 9 is to 10. Now they are saying overall he scored 60%. Since it is in proportion, the actual marks can be represented in the form of 5x, 6x, 7x, 8x, 9x and 10x. So adding all these up will give us the total value which is the total marks that he has obtained which is 45x. They have given that overall he has scored 60% which means this 45x is the marks he scored. So this upon the total marks will give us 60% which we can represent as follows. Now we know that the total mark is nothing but the maximum marks one can obtain out of these six papers. So let's make an assumption of maximum marks to be 100 for each paper. Since there are six papers, the total marks would be 6 into 100. So now we have represented his overall score of 60% in terms of equation. Cancelling these out, we will get the value of x to be 8. Now we can substitute this constant of proportion what we found out in individual papers and find out which papers have less than 60% of the marks. So for 5x we will get 5 eighths are 40, 6x we will get 6 eighths are 48, then 7x 56, 8x 64, 9x 72 and 10x is 80. Now we need to find out the number of papers in which he has scored less than 60%. Since we have taken the maximum marks of each paper as 100, we can directly count the papers in which the value is less than 60. So there are three papers in which he has secured less than 60. Therefore, option B is the right answer.